Good day to you wherever you're watching me from. It's a sunny and bright afternoon here in the city of Lagos. Are you an investor looking to start a family here in Lekki, Lagos, Nigeria? Are you looking to own a property that you can get a, an annual value from which you can rent out here in Lekki, Lagos, Nigeria? I've got a four bedroom terrace duplex here in Second Toll Gate by the Conservative Road. This property is in a secured and a serene estate and you know as usual i'm going to take you around this property before we tour a unit so that you can see what you're buying you can see what you're actually putting your money to and trust me this is a very good place to start a family if you're looking for where to start a family this is a very good place it is serene it is secured and it is the environment is very very quiet so let me just take you around so that you see how what i'm saying so stay with me let's tour around this property so as usual i'm going to start at the gates this is victory park estate and here we have two gates this is the first entrance and this is the second gate and we can see here that we have our security house in this area so coming in this estate you can see how serene it is already just by looking at the environment so here it's not jam-packed like any other place it's a very serene estate so by my left here we have the visitors car park so here if you have a visitor they have to park in this area for those that want to call before entering they have to park here so here we have the visitors car park and you can see right here by my right we have the car uh, the basketball court which unfortunately has been destroyed but it's going to be rebuilt back so here we have the basketball court and you can see other buildings that are in process on this environment so here we have our four bedroom terraces up to the extreme we also have at the other side there and here we have fully detached we have one semi detached there i'm going to check if it's available for sale or not but here we have a fully detached and we have fully detached over there and you can see how serene and secured this estate is. just take a look around take a look around this estate this is beautiful so here we have a four bedroom terrace duplex with a bq we have house for sale here in Lekki, Lagos, Nigeria, house for sale in Orchid, Lekki, Lagos, Nigeria. Now we're gonna tour the second building right here, this A2. And take note that the street light also has a CCTV camera. So this place is very secured. When I say it's secured, it's secured, and residents are already living in most of the houses in this area. So now I'm gonna take you on the tour on this A02 right here. I, I would have loved to start from A01, but we already have someone living there, so I can't go to the back. So let's just start from A02 right here. So I'm going to take you on the tour on this property right here. So coming in, you have your car space. Conveniently, this car can pack up to so three cars. You have two cars by this side, and you have one car facing here. You get so two cars here, one car facing here. So this place, this car park can conveniently park three cars you can see the nature vibe that is given the green area that is given around here so before we go far check here here we have the changeover switch and your prepaid meter they are all already in place for you so you can see the changeover switch for this apartment this is the prepaid meter and that is the changeover switch it is all ready for you here in this property now let me take you inside so you can see how beautiful the interior is. So check this out. This is the entrance coming in. Take note of this. One step, then coming in, this is beautiful. This is your living room. You have your living room here and you have your dining over there. This is your dining area this is your living room area so check out the lightning good chandelier with inbuilt lightning it comes with inbuilt lightning this is beautiful yes it is beautiful so here we have one of the rooms downstairs you can see the size of the room here 
and we have one of the room downstairs and you can see the windows of ventilation the lights and here we have the wardrobe and you can see here we have the toilet this is the toilet that's the sink this is the shower this is the water heater the toilet and this is the structure for smell so coming out we have a visitor's toilet right here this is our visitor's toilet you see the sink and the toilet and we have the extractor too over there so right about now we're going to the kitchen here we have the kitchen so coming in the kitchen straight down you will see the pantry and this pantry here it has a space for where you can do put your washing machine you can turn this to your laundry room your washing machine will be there or you turn it to your storehouse and coming in the kitchen this is a full view of the kitchen so you can see your cabinet this is the heat extractor the gas the oven right here your sink and you can see the water for the sink this is a clean water the water here is treated so it is clean so check out this cabinet right here and we also we have this right here in the kitchen too you can check out the pop and the lightning for this kitchen and remember i told you that we have a big queue here this is your backyard you can see how spacious the backyard is so you can see where you can dry your laundry like this person here dried their laundry back here so you can put your home here and you have a tap right here with a drainage system here so here we have the bq coming in the bq this is the size of the bq this is quite more than the normal size of bq that they usually do nowadays so you can see the lightning for this bq and coming in this is the toilet this is the toilet the sink and the shower for this bq So now we've finished touring downstairs. <clears throat> we finished touring downstairs. Now let's go upstairs and tour the first floor. So going up, least I forget, do you know that you can actually make this as an art for your room? If, yes, you can put uh, your art here or turn it to a library in this living room. So now let's go upstairs. wow this space is big for the staircase only so coming upstairs you can see the staircase wow we have a big a big family lounge here this is what they call a family lounge this is actually what they call a family lounge this family lounge is quite big now see the lightning for this Currently, we're on Nepal light. You get so currently, we're on Nepal light to tell you that we usually have light here. So, here you will have your TV and you have your chairs, possibly an L shaped chair, so you can have a family gathering upstairs instead of going downstairs. And here we have a balcony that you can actually watch from here outside. Now, you can see the view here. And the balcony is quite spacious too. You can have a couch here for the balcony. That's a one-seater couch. This is beautiful. So coming to the room, this is our second room. This is our second room. Wow. This room is quite big. And here we have the wardrobe. 
So going to the toilet, you can see here that we have the shower, the sink, and the toilet. And we have a water heater. And check out the lightning. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Now off to our third room. This is room number three. And you can see how spacious it is. A four by a four and a half by six bed will conveniently size this place and you will still have space right here. And this is the wardrobe. Coming in here, you get the toilet. Take notes of this towel hanger. That is the water heater. This is the sink. And you have a shower here. So note that when buying this house, put it in mind that you have to do some screening because I don't advise this kind of screening in this house. You have to repaint. If it's repainting, you have to repaint for this house. So now to our best part of the house, which is the master's bedroom. This is the size of the master's bedroom. And six by six bed can conveniently size here. Yes, six by six bed can conveniently size here. And by my left here, you can see that we have a mirror and our wardrobe. And you have space for shoes over there. This is space for shoe here. And a wardrobe. Oh, wow. And here we have your toilet. This is your sink. And your mirror. The shower. The water heater. And the toilet. So here you have your master's bedroom. So, this house is definitely beautiful. So, what do you think? So, guys, here I have Mr. Philip with me that is going to tell us more about this estate and the charges that are in this estate for those that want to buy a unit right here in Discovery Park Estate. So, Mr. Philip, over to you. So, what are other payments and what is the price of this particular building we are on? The price, uh, if uh, someone is interested in renting a space here, is a five million naira per annum. So it's five million naira per annum to yes. rent. Yes, to rent. So what about to sell? To, to buy. To buy is a uh, hundred and eighty million naira. A hundred and eighty million naira asking asking price, which is slightly negotiable. Yes. So what are other charges here for yes. someone interested in buying? For someone uh, interested in buying, uh, the other charges is only uh, the service charge. Okay, the service uh, charge. Annum. Yes, and currently that is 600,000 naira per annum. Okay. So that's how it just covers uh, the maintenance of uh, the common facilities. Okay. Uh, right in the estate. Okay, like what facilities, please? The facilities are the, uh, the evacuation of the sewage. The sewage is uh, centrally constructed. Okay. Then the uh, treatment of uh, the portable uh, clean, clean water. Okay. The residents are going to enjoy. Okay. Then uh, the uh, powering of the street lights, the security. The then, loma, yes. the cleaning. Yes, the, yes, the, the, loan, the cleaning and the maintenance of the uh, swimming pool. Okay, so there's the, a swimming pool here. Yes, yes, yes. Wow, uh, we need to yes. go see the swimming pool. Uh, it's under construction. It's under uh, construction, yes. but it's something I can still show my viewers, right? Uh, yes, yes. Uh, okay, uh, so we'll go check the swimming pool now. Uh, so that that's all for the house. Yes, yes. That's all okay, for the concerning the land title on this property, what does this property have for it, the land title? It requires a governor's consent. Governor's consent. Uh, does it have a building approval? And uh, yes, 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 it is not a building approval, all right? Okay. Yes, we've obtained permission from the building control agency in the uh, four years, the only year approved. Okay, yes, it has a building years. approval, and like you said, this property is selling for 180 yes, million yes, era, yes. and the annual uh, rent is yes, 5 million era. Yes, okay, all right, thank you very much. Now, let's go to the pool, let's go to the pool. Mr. Philip, you were saying this is the recreation center? Yes. Okay, so how is it a recreation center? Yes, uh, the ground floor we house uh, the offices for the facility management. Okay. Then the other side will be for the developer's office. Okay. Then the middle will be for the supermarket where the residents. Okay, are. there's going to yes. be a supermarket. Yes, can easily walk in and you know and buy. Uh, and buy things, yes, groceries. Yes, yeah. Yes, yeah. Okay. Groceries. 
while the first floor will be uh, the gym, the gym hall. Okay, the gym hall. Yes, install all the latest uh, gym facilities. Oh, okay. Yes, so uh, there's a gym house yes, right yeah, here. Gym house, and yes. you said something about the lounge. Where's the lounge going yes, to be? The lounge will be on the last floor. Oh, okay. Where, where the resident will have a little to hold their private party. Okay, uh, okay. Yes, it also okay. comes with its uh, uh, convenience. Convenience, uh, convenience. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Uh, all right. All right. At the rear, rear side of the building is yeah. proposed uh, swimming pool. Okay. Yes, we are going to start in. Uh, I thought I thought this this a uh, yes, basketball court. Exactly. Yes, basketball court. Okay. So yes, what uh, happened to it? Uh, to what happened uh, to was that uh, we suspended uh, the construction. Okay. Right. Yes, because of the ongoing uh, beside it. But now we want to revamp it again and make it uh, functional very soon. Okay. Yes. Okay. You're revamping this. I so guess. where is the supposed swimming pool? It's supposed to be put be at the right side of this. Uh, can we go? Can we go? Can we go there? Yeah. Okay, here is the proposed yeah, space yeah, for the swimming yeah, pool. Okay. Yes. And work is scheduled to commence by the end of this month. Oh, okay. We start the excavation proper. Oh, okay, yes. for the swimming yes, pool. Yes, swimming pool. All right, thank you very much. So what do you think? You like what you see, right? This property is currently going for 180 million Naira. Yes, this four bedroom, terrace duplex with a BQ, feeded kitchen, all and suit room is going for 150 million era and it is it is in a serene and secured estate here in uh conservation road so thank you we've come to the end of this video thank you for staying to the end and please don't forget to like comment and subscribe let me know your opinion about this building let me know your opinion about the environment here in this in this estate let me know what you think and if you're interested in getting the unit my number is currently showing on the screen give me that call today send me a dm on whatsapp let me bring you here for the to inspect this property and if you have any other inquiry on this property don't hesitate to give me a call i am right here to attend to you so we've come to the end of this video thank you very much and please don't forget to like comment and subscribe please don't just watch please don't just watch subscribe please and on your notification so that you get our next video when next we post thank you very much for staying to the end and see you on my next video till then stay blessed bye bye